Hi, it's Jira again today, back with another video. In this video, we're going to be looking at Citra 3DS Emulator, black screen and load fixes. Now, I've come across something by chance, and I would like you to try it out and tell me what you think. So, basically, what we're going to do is we're going to go into the Citra 3DS Emulator there. You can see the list of my games there. If you notice now, Pokemon does boot up in terms of like right at the beginning, but as soon as you go to enter the game, it then cuts out. But I've noticed something a little different. So what we're going to do is, we're going to go into our settings. Now when you install this, you'll get uh, some of the settings been checked. So if you look at the video back end here, and it says enable uh, hardware render, that would already been ticked. And enable hardware shader. Now I've turned this off. And this is by chance, because it wouldn't load. So when you download and install it, this would already be checked. So I've turned it off. And I've, but I've kept everything the same on here. So... So the V-Sync's on, uh, emulator clock speed. Oh no, tell a lie, sorry. It has kept my original settings. Uh, so we're just going through briefly. So enable JIT compiler for shaders. Uh, enable V-Sync. Over emulated CPU clock speed. And I've got mine at the moment, it's 150. I might just turn that down a minute. Maybe it might be a little bit too high. Um, I'm just gonna put it on. I'm just gonna put it down back to 90 a minute. So, and that's my sentence. Emulated region is auto. And all the other settings you can see is turned off. So, my apologies for just saying that. Um, so, it's some of my settings, but I've just turned off the enable hardware shader. So, let's come back out to that. And now, let's go into Pokemon Omega Ruby. Nope, doesn't want to just load up, but it's quite there. So let's just come into that again. So we're going to go into the sand again. Maybe I'll turn that down too much. So emulate clock speed, I'll go back until 150 a minute. Okay, so. Yeah, maybe not enough. So, what we're going to do is uh, I use the second setting. So, the shader is turned off now. Hopefully, it boots. There it is. There it goes. It boots. Now, it did not boot before, folks, when I had the shader checked. So just so you know, it is booting. Now my phone is only a Sony Xperia Z, so it's nothing special, but just to show that this game now does boot.
So there you go folks, here we're in. And we're going through the game now. The speed is only 12 frames per second. I'm sure if you got more powerful phones, it'll be a lot more better. So let's come out of here. Let's try another game. So with that said, so with the, the so let's just go back to the settings a minute. Let's have a look. So if you're going through this folks, I'll go through a quickly of this. So emulate region is also uh, audio stretch and leave video back end so leave that one on so enable hardware sh shader folks is the one you got to turn off now i don't know if that makes a massive difference to say a more powerful phone i don't know um so enable accurate multiple uh, multiple uh, multiple uh, i forget it and hardware shaders leave it unchecked enable accurate geometric geometric shaders um uh, unchecked enable JIT compiler for shaders I might even try turning that off don't know yet internal resolution is kept at zero enable vsync override emulated CPU clock speed emulated clock speed I've got mine at 152% uh, stereos, stereos uh, copy leave that one alone in depth that's off as well so while we're here let's try another game Another game that didn't seem to boot, and I'll see if it does boot now, and that's Marrow and Sonic Real 2016 Olympic Games. Will it boot? No, it doesn't want to boot. Paper Mario Sticker Star. Nope, it doesn't want to boot. So I think it's a case that you can have to look at some settings and just see what works for your device. So there you go, we've seen Pokemon over the Ruby boot and boot into game. So I found that as by chance, by turning off the enable hardware shader, it seemed to then go, go into game. So we enjoyed the video, stay tuned for more videos and I shall see you in the next one. Bye for now.